Hello Nintendo Chit Chatters, I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. Welcome to Concept Revolt on the Nintendo 3DS. This is some preview footage for you. The game releases on the 3DS in North America on October 3rd. Shoutouts to NIS America for providing a copy of the game. And Concept Revolt is a card game and board game kind of mixed together. Now Cult has been around for a long, long time. Actually, this is the 20th anniversary year in 2017. So shoutouts to NIS America again for providing a copy. And let's dive into some preview coverage for you guys of Cold Set Revolt on the 3DS. And here we go guys, a real match. It's on. The experiment to gain back your memory has reached its final stage. Let's review everything you need to know about a scepter battle. Come defeat me with all of your knowledge you have. This time we'll do something different. This will be a real match. That said, it doesn't seem like you've regained all your memory just yet, therefore explain how this will work. In this battle, whoever reaches the magic goal of 7000G and then crosses the gate first will win. Use the dice to move and summon creatures in the lands you stop on to gain more territory. Now let's begin. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. The gold cursor will show you tips for the next move. If you don't feel confident, look at this cursor as a reference. However, this cursor isn't perfect. Sometimes your own plans will wind up better. It's important not to rely too much on the cursor and to think for yourself. You can toggle the advice cursor on or off in settings. All right. Let's roll. Four. Go this way. Let's put, um... This red org. Right there. Alright, Alicia's turn. So we had a red org on the fire land. Where's she going? Oh, okay. Alright, she's on vacant land, which is air. And she's summoning this wall of stone creature. Okay. It's your turn. So by using spell cards, you can interfere with your opponent or give yourself an advantage. Okay, good idea. So we got fighter creature. What spells do we have? We do have... Uh, this for six dice, so let's use it. Alright, let's see here. Fighter creature. We use a wall of stone as well. Summon him right there. So there's two wall of stones set up here. One for me, one for Alicia. Oh, big roll. Both of her statues will be displayed on color tabs called scepter panels on the bottom screen. If you touch a scepter panel, you will be able to see the cards in the scepter's hands. Cool. Another magma hammer, awesome. The final gate awaits you. Alright. Yes, uh, do the rock troll. Summon him there. She's getting some really good rolls right now. <clears throat> Alright, Alicia. So you can also summon a creature land doesn't match is also a valid tactic. Having lot of land will increase your lap bonus as well as interfere with enemies' plans. Okay. 
Of course, there's terrain change as well. Got a red org. Awesome. Nice. Love these rewards. see here. Uh, level him up. So once you do a land level up, your turn does end. fighter creature. Alright. She had a chain of two right now. I'm going to be very careful. So, plenty of tutorial in this game, which is great. And there's also an electronic guide by pressing the start menu. That's good. So we got chain mail. That's pretty good. Summon this guy here. Chain of two. Yellow org creature. All right, Alicia. Five. Perfect. <laughs> I was hoping she'd go into my creature, my my warrior, my fighter there, but no. Just be a level up here. It looks like. Oh, she's going to exchange creatures, okay. For the yellow org. The right creature in the right place. Discard your cards. She getting ready the fighter creature. Alright. Good ta good tactic. Squareen creature, nice. Let's see. Might go into battle here, we'll see. Let's do a battle, let's see what happens. All right, so we're gonna use our magma hammer. The battle was dry. Awesome. Took a toll. These squaring creatures look pretty neat. <laughs> Some of the cards are pretty cool. Nobody owns that land. Skeleton creatures in the water. Interesting. It's your turn. Ten. Okay. See here. Um, do land level up. My lands grow ever stronger. Discard your cards. Uh, what do I get word of? Um, pro uh, well, get rid of the mana spell. Holy word spell she got. Let's 
to summon creatures here. She's getting a lot of territory. I need to be very careful here. I need to summon more creatures as well. I need to get some more territory. Come on. Chain of three. Battle axe. Nice. I'm a battle axe. Put a squareen down, I guess. Alright, it's so a goblin creature. She's lapping. This Flogiston is pretty cool. I like the way it looks. Might have like a Pokemon. Alright, Chimera creature, nice. I like those. Nine. Let's see here. Um, leveling up him. Let's get rid of the. Uh, where the battle axe? Mana spell. So I just got rid of. She drew it. Ooh, she's actually using it right now. Empty space, oh. Yeah, she has a lot of territories right now. I gotta be very careful of this. Hmm. <laughs> Chain of three, I think, right there, huh? Alright, ooh, fly spell. Let's use that. Three dice. Yeah, probably... Nothing to do. Ooh, a Blitz Raven. Attacks first. Not much HP on it, though. It's like, pretty weak. We're gonna have some battling here because a lot of the land is taken up now. Is she gonna battle me? Or get the toll? She's gonna battle. Goblin here versus my fighter. Let's see here. Alright. So we can use our chainmail for some extra stat boost. Better HP, doubles. Luckily we did that because my HP uh, doubled there <laughs> to 80. She had 40 in damage, take me down 40, so. Good job. Nice. A dragon zombie. Um, let's roll. 12. See, I guess leveling up. Leveling up a lot. Exchanging creatures. Good 
The right creature in the right place. It's your turn. Spark ball, wow. Awesome. Love the music here, by the way. Uh, what do I have here? You know what? It's gonna end. Discard your cards. Gotta discard. Um. Yeah, we'll go to the Minotaur. We'll keep our spells that we have. Be good for battle. Another Flogston creature. She uh, is true. Good job. Good luck on your next journey. It's your turn. A woodful creature, nice. All right, let's see here. Don't want to move or return. We're just going to end, I guess. Yeah. Toll taken. Um, let's see. This guy is the weakest, so we'll get rid of him. So a little arrow. The golden arrow does help with a recommendation. But again, it's not set in stone. So do take a pause and look at your board and your cards. I'm using a spell. All right, add three dice. Yeah, she has three right there in a row. And she's leveling up her land now, too. Gotta be very careful of that. Magic Bull. We're gonna use this. Um... Oh, it's destroyed his creature or her creature. The final gate that was nice. Not enough G. So, what is what we need to do here? Oh, we can exchange. Yeah, we can level up or. Yeah, okay, so. I'll we'll put a land creature here, Dragon Zombie, in exchange. It's a good idea. She's getting those holy word um, spells. Oh. Okay. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> I gained dice. That was an awesome spell that I had attacking her creature. We destroyed her creature from the land. So she'll be leveling up here. We're really low on G. We use a lot to um, level up our land. Right, some scale armor. Alright. The fighter creature down. Summon him there. So a chain of four. Mace item. She's battling me here. 
So... It says no item, but I don't know if she's going to be using a spell or not, so... I'm just adding extra ability for myself. Yeah, there we go. I probably didn't have to use that. It didn't recommend it either, but you never know. So we have a lot of Gs now, and she's low on G. Gas Cloud Creature. Wow, cool. Alright, let's summon a creature. Uh, we can put the Red Org here. Nice. Alright, feel a little bit more confident. Is she gonna level up or no? Or exchange? Yeah, exchanging. For the Aqualing creature. Those are pretty cool. HP is only 30, so we can attack that. A sling! That's a pretty cool little item. All right. So let's level up his land. Level four. Rather than battling her there, we leveled up. Hopefully she lands over there. <laughs> I'm hoping. Good lap bonus. Is she gonna exchange or what? Oh, she's looking to level up. When she levels up, she just goes to level two. I go to like level three or four. I'm not sure if that's a good idea if I should do it incrementally more or not. We'll see. Statue creature, alright. Six. Yeah, we probably should level up that, huh? Level 5! Nice. Oh, I can't wait till she um, lands on that. Now we'll go to the Magma Hammer. Ooh, Wall of Ice. Look at that card. That's neat. Mana Spell. So lucky to land on an empty space with nobody claiming this land here yet. Oh man, there's gonna be some good battles here. It's your turn. I have enough total magic to reach the goal. Well, that's cool. Let's put this uh, statue creature here. Chain of five. That's great. The final gate awaits you. Is she gonna attack or what? Yep, with her skeleton creature. HP of forty. Here we go. I'm gonna attack first. Done. The defense was too strong. Awesome. So if we get to the gate now, we win. We have enough magic to meet the goal. It's got a good roll. Not quite. We're gonna attack. Uh, we're gonna use the Chimera. Chimera. 
<laughs> oh, sweet. Animation. So she's in trouble. Big trouble. All we have to do is get to the end, to the gate here. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see though. I mean, it could, the tides could turn. You never know. Luckily, she landed on her own territory again. She's gonna level up. Oh, she's gonna exchange again, okay. For the skeleton, for the wall of ice. Good exchange. The right creature in the right place. It's your turn. Let's do this. Let's get a big roll, come on. What was, what was that? What card was that? That was cool. Phoenix creature, awesome. There we go. All right, we did it. Goal achieved. So we reached a total goal of 7,000 G. Did I win? Yes, the victory is yours. Such overwhelming power. That was an absolutely amazing battle. Let's see, you've completely regained all of your skills as a scepter. So this is the scepter's power. It's like my body remembers this power. Lovely. So you've regained the rest of memories, too. No, I still can't remember. Who am I, or where I came from? I see. However, I learned this... I learned from this battle that you're not an enemy. Let me officially welcome you. Eddie and Zizi, I'm happy to say, welcome to the Free Bats! And there we go. Beating up on Alicia there and G's. Wow. It was pretty even there for about halfway through, and then it really just took over um, in that match. Took a screenshot. That's pretty cool. Nice. So Quest is a game mode that involves the storyline. When you clear a stage, a new stage will appear. The Rebels. New quest unlocked. Who are the Free Bats and what is their goal? Cool. Alright guys, so we finished uh, the Awakening. In the darkness, you awaken the powers to your powers as a scepter. So, six stages, the quest is clear. And then soon we'll be doing the Rebels in our next video. Who are the Free Bats and what is their goal? Three stages. So thanks for watching, guys. Of some Cold Sept Revolt on the 3DS preview footage. The game comes out on October 3rd, so make sure you get your pre-orders in now. And shoutouts to NS America again for the preview copy of the game. I'm Eddie Ray Ford, NintendoChitChat.com. See you guys right back here next time. Bye, everybody.